Delphi Automotive's SUV arrived in the New York City area after a 3,500-mile cross-country journey that started in San Francisco. And for part of the trip, the car was driving itself. The vehicle uses GPS, sensors, and cameras to steer through traffic and brake on its own. The car actually handled it extremely well. CNET's Wayne Cunningham took a ride in the new car. When it saw other cars around it, it slowed down. It was following the lane lines, too. Delphi joined several other automakers and tech companies developing self-driving autonomous vehicles that could be ready in five years. Mercedes even created this futuristic concept car to show what a driverless vehicle may look like down the road. Some of the technology already exists. Many vehicles on the market, like this Mercedes, can slow down in traffic and take over steering if the driver veers off course. But the path to total autonomy faces a major roadblock. Most states have yet to pass legislation that would let self-driving cars on the road. In fact, the Delphi vehicle could only drive hands-free in certain states that allow testing. The states are going to have to come up with their own laws uh, governing cars that are run autonomously. There are also questions about insurance coverage in a self-driving accident. Those issues will need to be addressed before these cars hit the open road. Lauren Lister, CBS News, New York.